Hey everybody, this is Dominic. I am down here with Fred and Kevin. Hey, what is going on over here? What did we build? So uh, what we did, Dominic, was uh, last year we had too many tailings in our pond. So we wanted to find a way to keep the tailings out from building up in the pond. So we built a little creek system okay. with some obstruction. Allow the, the tailings to settle over here and not go all the way down in our pond. And the pumps are down there in the pond. tailings covering up our pumps and plugging things up. So what we did was, because we have so many machines, we built several little water channels down the side of that hill. Okay. The idea is for the tailings to build up in this little creek system and to begin to back up up the hill a little bit. Now as we go, we're probably going to have to add some rocks and things, but those are going to build up. The tailings will stop here. We cut a little channel right down the side. And that channel funnels the water to this rock wall. The rock wall stops all the larger material from going over. Then we have a little bit of an S curve here to give it another opportunity to settle. And if you look down in this S curve, you'll see when I reach the bottom here, though, this is after a day and a half of running, that I don't have a whole lot of tailing. That's all the way to the bottom. There's not much there. So because it's all getting it's stopped a, back there. It's all getting stopped by this rock wall. Okay. And then it S curves around, goes into the pond, and all you have is muddy water and not large, large sets of tailings that things up. So one of the things that you were sharing with me is if the water wasn't running here, we could really easily see inside bins and whatever. So where would you say the material that is here builds up? It you... builds up right here. You can see the top, that can help with this, but as it comes around, there's a little bit of a backlog here, and there's a nice smooth inside bend. Now that material on this inside bend is building up right here. Okay. So, so as you see it, that takes the last of the tailings that might escape our wall, gives it another opportunity to settle down a little bit. Awesome. Uh, Kevin, what do you think about all this? You've done a fine job. Fine job. awesome? I mean, anybody can just dig a pond, but this is a pond and a tailings bed with a river channel in the middle. You tell me your rigs are running and it's working fine. Yesterday that trauma was pushing, what, you, what did you say? Like, we, we, we did about, we estimated we did about five and a half yards of material, uh, maybe almost six through that, just that trauma, not to mention all the other machines. Okay, and then we got one, two, three, four. We got one bouncing kind of half and half, one we'll get going, but that's a lot of material that we're running and it's staying right up here. All right, folks, thank you very much. We appreciate it. From Stanton Camp, this is Dominic, Fred, and Mike. See you next time.